car parts, interior car parts. Just looking for junk and stuff and things. Old washer and dryer inside of the washer bin that spins around. Well, let's walk back down a little ways, see if we find anything else. And, uh, and then we'll head up this road some more. It seems to follow right along. Ooh, yeah, a layer of agate. All of it that I've been finding up here is stuck in this redstone. Might get to some spot where we can actually find the layers, although having them already ripped out for you is about as good as it gets. Pretty stuff. Yeah. Cool. That <laughs> made this stop worth it. Okay. We're gonna keep a look in. A grinding bowl and a one pound common opal, that'll work for me. Whenever you find a rock that you like, your best way to find more is to look around in that area, of course, but to identify the rock that it came from, its host rock, the strata that it's stuck in. And that would be this orange stuff for this particular stone, so that's what we'd be looking for more of, is big chunks of that, uh, rock faces of it, mm. Is that a bunch of it up there? And that's that's how you sniff out the deposits. Seeing an underlayer here of this. Ooh. What that are you? Anything cool? Yeah. A layer of this orange here might be where some of that's coming from. Where am I? We just kept taking lefts and rights and Look at this beautiful stone. It's gorgeous. Oh, almighty, oh look at it. The sun is shining down in this right now, and you can just look everywhere. See everything. What are we going to find? Yay. Quartz layers coming through here and the rock underneath. Follow them along. And look at this. That's a huge patch of quartz. So this is the bedrock that the creek is ground down to. And that is just all quartz. There could be lots of gold in there. Okay, so we're about that far down from the bridge, and I see here a footing poured cement block. And take a look, it's deep down here like it should be. It was the old bridge. Looks like they put it kind of behind this boulder here, where the boulder lodged there. And the one, woo, pretty dang deep, folks. There it is. So let's climb up on it. The old wood's still stuck in it, so. Jeez. I guess this is the old crossing. Uh, that was a while back. I'd like to go up there and push through the woods and stuff, but it has gotten thick. I guess I could easily just go back over there and meet where their new road is. But yeah, there must be the rest of this down there somewhere. Pretty cool. Wish I was a metal detector guy. Imagine downstream, that's all bedrock. So what we were looking at was the quartz in it. Let's go ahead and walk it. Alright, this would be the right kind of spot. Cool stuff on either side too. Maybe we will go up there for a second. Even the truck parts with the keys unlocked in it, so can't go too far. 
I guess it makes sense that it would be there because the rest of this is gravel fill and that's right on the hard rock. So you, you drive across where it's hard rock and it's shallow. This is a natural fuel fording point. You see there's meadow up above it there. And the bedrock just continues on. So it's good hunting too. Metal in the water piled up here. Looks like probably a piece of the bridge. You see it would be to hold a pretty long beam. That's as long as my leg there. And then another big old chunk. Some big nails. I don't know if they uh, got deposited here or rotted out of a log here. But it's pretty cool. Chunkage. As far as I'm going to go down, I think I'm going to keep exploring up the road and see what there is. So thank you for joining me thus far. We're going to wake our, work our way back up here. I'll show you if there's anything else I find. Okay, we are exploring. It's like a billion old townships out here. Well, we have left the river and <laughs> we are uh, climbing up and up and up and up and up here. The driver says, what are we doing, boss? Uh, we're driving out of that gorge that we were in and back into some strip of mountains. We're in uh, mid to northern California here. That's all I can really tell you, somewhere between Lake County and uh, Highway 101. Pretty cool. And I don't know if it's a through road or not. It's kind of going. So this is where we are at. Um, way left my neck of the roads. And we are headed up into Somewhereville. But, oh, sun's right on it. There's a real conical peak in front of us. It's like an actual conical rock point to it. That was pretty cool. Pyramid Mountain. Rising up here at the top. And the vast lands out in the distance. That's what you gotta love about California in the west. And everywhere, I guess. Look at that meadow down there. I wanted to show you this. I don't know. It's going to pick up well, but that was that pointy tip. Look, it's an ancient eroded face. See it? Or Wolf Mountain. This whole thing looks like it could be caves back in here. See how it goes down? There's a pullout right here. So, so where we're at, this is the back valley. That's where I was shooting the last shot from, was down there on the corner of the road. And there's that super conical hill. Wonder if there's a path. There is a bit of a path here. We have to be careful because a lot of pot growers out here, honestly. I, mean, I don't want to get killed and dead for messing around in their zone. But we will go through spooky land out here. Try and get up to this rock. Why not? Why not? Well, there's 50 reasons, but. Oh, I see the face up there. Come on. Oh, it's a rock rock. Just rises up steeply. I don't see any caves right there. We are definitely on the slopes of it. It's kind of a choice in pathways here. We go ahead back up this way. I 
in the boulder field at its bottom. Ooh, looks cool. Yeah, this is cave land. deep that is. Pretty much a fisher, but fishers can go a long way. Let's go back down and around. Oh, there's Drover. He's going to back us up. I can actually see the truck. So. We okay, boss? We okay. A long ways up. That is cool. That path goes up to Wanderlust. Climbing through the poison oak. We'll go out here. I don't know if we're going to try and go to the top top. I'm sure we got a lot of faces to check out. Well, we'll see what view is here. Don't fall. Oh yeah. This is... We are up there. Awesome. I guess from here... Well, it looks like it winds out to the face. Oh man. Ooh, there he is. There's the head. Pretty darn cool, man. Looking out over the valley on the conical peak. Oh, it's getting steeper. Ah. Well, that's how you get to the true Indiana Jones treasure, you know? Lord. Look at that view. Oh. That is just steep ass down in all directions. I think this is too steep. I'm just going to stop here. I don't have a buddy with me and didn't tell anybody where I was going, so I'm breaking a lot of rules. But, I got us up to right here. It just keeps extending higher and higher. We'll come back here if we get a chance for sure. Okay, now, literally, make our way back down. Well, wind is coming up and we hit a dead end, so I'm going to call it done for this little adventure. It's the end of the Nameless River Road and the mountains are back, so thank you.